We begin with developing news here in France. Four children and at least one adult have been injured in a stabbing attack in the city of Ancy. Ancy is in the Alps in eastern France. And in a tweet, the country's interior minister said the attacker has been taken into custody. Now, two of the four children and the adult are said to be in life-threatening condition. Let's hear from a witness. I hear people shouting, run, run. I was surprised. I continued what I was doing. And then I saw the man right in front of me on the grass. And I saw policemen about five or ten meters behind him who couldn't catch him. He headed towards me, so I got out of the way. Then I saw him running straight towards elderly men, women and children. Then he attacked an elderly man. And for more on this, I'm joined on set by France 21st Charlie James. Charlie, I understand we're learning some new information about how many people may have been injured. That's right. So the number of victims reported since we learned about this attack has fluctuated. That's expected. But the latest numbers that we're getting from local authorities is that it is four children and two adults who have been injured. Now, the number severely injured still stands at two children and one adult. But uh, six total is now the new number that we have from local authorities. Now, just to tell you a little bit more about how this attack unfolded, around 9.45 a.m. This morning, a group of children were at a park in the city of Ancy uh, when they were brutally attacked by a man with a knife. Witnesses say that he jumped into the playground area and started shouting. Uh, he then began running towards the strollers and stabbing at random. People, of course, started screaming and running. And all of this unfolded over the course of just four minutes before police were able to tackle the man and arrest him. Um, now, the kids that are involved, as you can imagine, they were at a playground, are believed to be very young. The two children in critical condition are believed to be three years old. But some of the victims were in strollers when they were attacked. What are we learning about the suspect? So police have not said very much publicly about the suspect, except that he is a male. Uh, and police sources, however, have spoken to Reuters news agency and said that the attacker is a Syrian national with legal refugee status. Now, he was not known to police before, which means that he did not have a prior criminal record. And we do not know anything as of now about the motive behind a heinous attack like this. Uh, that and the attacker's identity are being further investigated. And while there have been public attacks in France before, the fact that children were targeted in the middle of the morning at a playground like this, this has really shaken the nation. And uh, French President Emmanuel Macron Cron called it an attack of absolute cowardice. The National Assembly held a minute of silence in support of the victims and their families this morning. And the mayor of Ancy is expected to be giving a press conference uh, very soon. And we are expecting to get more information about the investigation from him. And you can see from these images that we're showing, it's just an idyllic setting there in Ancy, just unimaginable that something like this would happen, especially on a playground. I mean, this is a vacation area. It happened near the Lac d'Ancy, a lake that is a huge tourist attraction. So we have heard from witnesses you know, from the UK and around Europe. Uh, so it's just unbelievable in general. But I mean, for people who are here enjoying the beautiful weather, this was the last thing that they expected to happen. Absolutely. Okay. France 24's Charlie James following the latest developments out of Ancy for us. Charlie, thanks so much.